So today I'm talking about a Toyota with the P0452 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. So what is a Toyota P0452 code? Well, it's an evaporative emission control system, pressure sensor intermittent. And what does this mean? Well, modern cars have an EVAP system that helps contain all the gas vapors inside the gas tank and they get sent back into the engine and get burnt off so they don't escape into the atmosphere. And there's a sensor inside of here that monitors what's going on and the onboard computer seeing the issue with it. So I have to be troubleshooting, know why. And some of the possible causes of this, well, it could be a bad fuel tank pressure sensor it could be in the wiring and it could possibly be an evap leak although usually if you have an evap leak you'll get other codes so if you are getting other codes you might want to check that out but if you're just getting a p0452 code it's going to be something going on with the pressure sensor and so the first thing to do is to go locate the fuel tank pressure sensor and it's usually located on a fuel pump although there can be some variations on some toyotas sometimes it could be located on the charcoal canister but quite commonly it is located on the fuel pump so like in this example it's up underneath the back seat there's a cover you pop it off the fuel pump will be underneath there and then the fuel tank pressure sensor is right on the fuel pump but again it can vary a little bit on where it's located so you might have to google it for your particular toyota but first thing to do locate the fuel tank pressure sensor and then once you locate it check out this wiring real good be sure that it's connected good there's no open shorts anything like this because any problem with the wiring is going to cause the same issue as a bad sensor so you want to make sure that's good and be sure there's no blown fuses since this whole circuit is on a fuse and once you check that out, once you know that the wiring's all good, there's no blown fuses or anything like that, then you can either test or replace the fuel tank pressure sensor. And most people would just go and replace it since it's a low cost part. I'll jump over on Amazon, give you an idea of what it looks like and how much it's going for right now. It looks like it's going for around 36, 32, $37. So it's not super high cost part or nothing. But like I said, you could test it if you wanted to. But at this point, if you checked out the wiring and that's all good and there's no blown fuses, then very likely that fuel tank pressure sensor has gone bad and simply needs to be replaced. And so that's basically it. I just want to give a real quick brief overview of how you go about fixing a Toyota with the P0452 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you. Please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.